The Hunnam Fertilizer Complex of Korea is making a big stride in its efforts for carrying out the new five-year plan. Officials and technicians of the complex go among workers to find out unreasonable points of the gasification process important for normalized production and increase the output of fertilizer with rational operating method. The Sinpo canned fish factory has been remodeled and inaugurated in South Hamgyong province of Korea. The factory has established a computer-integrated manufacture system of its production and management and ensured hygienic safety of the products, which will be conducive to improving the people's living. Minister of Fisheries Song chun seop and officials concerned looked around the factory on February 28th. The officials and researchers of the Pyongyang Floriculture Institute are actively intensifying their research work. They are trying to acclimatize the famous flower seeds of the world to the conditions of Korea, while intensifying the researches to increase the production by putting the flower cultivation on a scientific and industrial basis. The Samilpo Specialities Factory is producing more and more foodstuffs of different kinds conducive to the improvement of the people's diet. The factory is directing efforts to expanding the variety of foodstuffs with raw materials rich in Korea and improving their quality. It is also developing new products. The Ryugyong Kimchi factory in Pyongyang increases production while concentrating efforts on preserving the traditional flavor of the Korean kimchi. The factory pushes ahead with the work to satisfy the daily increasing demand of the people in accordance with the industrial production of kimchi. Workers and technicians of the factory direct efforts to preserving the unique taste of the Korean kimchi of different kinds. The mushroom factories increase the production, giving priority to science and technology. The Dugyong mushroom factory accelerates the production, solving the technical problems arising in cultivation, including full operation of equipment and application of nutrients. The Tetsu Mushroom Factory is increasing the production while directing efforts to solving substrate issues for different kinds of mushrooms and introducing mushroom spawn production method according to varieties. The South Pyongyang Provincial Old People's Home has been wonderfully built and inaugurated. The old people's home with hip saddle roof of Korean style has dining rooms, fitness rooms, clinic, recreation hall, and library so that the health seekers can enjoy a cultural and emotional life in good health. Leading officials of South Pyongyang province looked around the newly built old people's home on February 28th. The power producers across the Democratic People's Republic of Korea are striving for increased production. Thanks to the efforts of power producers in different parts of the country, including the Pukchang Thermal Power Complex, good production results have been recorded up to now in February, and the work for maintaining and reinforcing the production basis is propelled with vigor. The Supung power station and other hydro power stations across the country are accelerating the technical reconstruction of the equipment and are repairing the generating facilities in a qualitative way to operate them at full capacity. 
The Hits on Silk Mill in the Democratic People's Republic of Korea is now concentrating efforts on boosting the productivity. The mill has solved scientific and technological problems arising in raising the utility rate of the equipment through the mass technical innovations. It has also promoted the technical reconstruction of the production processes, laying a firm material and technical foundation for the normalization of production. National customs are actively encouraged in the Democratic People's Republic of Korea. The Mangyongdae District General Tailor Shop in Pyongyang and other tailor shops and Korean custom tailor shops across the country make traditional Korean skirt or chima and jacket or jogori according to ages and liking of the women and seasonal characteristics. Korean jacket and trousers for men and rainbow striped dress for children are also made with peculiar styles, patterns and colors preserving the unique taste of the national costume. Efforts are made in different factories in the field of light industry to improve the quality of the products. The Mindule Notebook Factory has introduced a new method of management allowing active participation of officials and workers in the work for improving the quality of notebooks. The Pyongyang Kim Jong-suk Silk Mill has established a new quality checking system and is encouraging all its employees to ensure the quality of the products to the maximum. The Pyongyang Dental Hygiene Products Factory has taken the quality analysis as a key to improvement of quality. It is steadily improving the quality inspection means and method. Efforts are directed to recycling at light industrial factories in the Democratic People's Republic of Korea. The Hamung Nitwear factory in South Samgyeong province has established a technical process to produce hosiery of different shapes by using byproducts, getting great profits. The Songcheonggang bag factory is concentrating efforts on recycling to actively introduce various technologies for improving the quality while lowering the production costs. The Ryuan footwear factory in Pyongyang is using byproducts and improving the quality of the product at the same time. The field of chemical industries making innovations in production by dint of science and technology. Officials and workers of the February 8th Vinalon complex have considered science and technology to be a way out for carrying out the chemical goods production plan and are solving the technological problems arising in the localization of catalysts by depending on their own technical force. Technicians of the Namhung Youth Chemical Complex are actively introducing advanced technology capable of producing more fertilizer with the same raw materials, making a breakthrough in production. The Hungnam Fertilizer Complex is increasing fertilizer production every day by improving the technical indexes of water electrolysis and producing more hydrogen. The Sinuzu textile mill in North Pyongan province of Korea is effecting an upsurge in production. The mill induces its employees to operate machines as demanded by the standard working method and technical regulations while steadily raising the level of knowledge of science and technology and improving the technical knowledge and skills. It has also streamlined equipment to boost the productivity. The mill is revitalizing production through active movement of undertaking many spindles and looms. More than 140 young people in Nampur City of the Democratic People's Republic of Korea volunteered to work at over 20 farms in the city, including the Tsongsan Cooperative Farm in Gangseo District and the Kumdang Cooperative Farm in Onsan County. A meeting was held at the Nampo City Art Theatre on the 4th to congratulate them. Present there were Park Chol Min, chairman of the Central Committee of the Kim Il-sung is the Kim Jong Il is the Youth League, Song Sung Chol, chairman of the Nampo City People's Committee, officials concerned officials of the Youth League and working youth in the city. Speeches were made at the meeting. A performance of the art squad of the Central Committee of the Youth League was given to congratulate the youth who were seen off by officials, young people, and working people in the city. 
Officials and workers in the field of metallurgical industry in the Democratic People's Republic of Korea are making innovations in the iron and steel production. The Kimchak Iron and Steel Complex has raised the operating rate of the oxygen blast furnace and increased the output of the molten iron to normalize the iron production every day. The Hwanghe Iron and Steel Complex has mapped out a plan to produce iron and steel two times more than last year's and continues to increase the production of the molten iron. The Cholima Steel Complex is making successes by directing efforts to the iron and steel production while concentrating efforts on readjusting and reinforcing the production basis. Successes are being made as cement producers of Korea. The Sangwon Cement Complex is concentrating efforts on the management of equipment and technical management to normalize production and actively pushing ahead with the modernization project to increase cement production. The Sangwon Limestone Mine has increased the actual working ratio of the mining equipment, making a contribution to the increased cement production. The Suncheon Cement Complex is perfecting the production processes technically to improve the productivity and quality of cement. Officials and employees of the Mindele Notebook Factory are making innovations in notebook production. The factory has set it as the main business strategy to localize and recycle raw and other materials and put spurs to its realization and operate the equipment at full capacity. Thus, it is producing a lot of notebooks of different kinds for the kindergarten children, primary and junior and senior middle school children and university students. The factory is now ensuring the proportion of localization of raw and other materials on a high level. The Suncheon Area Youth Coal Mining Complex of Korea is increasing production. While normalizing coal production, the complex is raising the proportion of mechanization in the face work. In this way, the complex is directing efforts to strengthening the material and technical foundations for coal production.